everybody, it's me, Kiara Zina Cheetah, and I don't I don't like saying my name in public. It makes it gives people power over me. I'm like a demon. Say it. Blitz Fox. <laughs> dun dun dun. <laughs> um cue in the lightning bolt and the the thunderclap. <laughs> Anyhow, um obviously we're going to be doing something a little different ish. Uh, but the Curse of Monkey Island. I figure most of the games you play aren't that far from adventure games. True. The only difference is I don't think this is horror. Yeah, like it's not horror. It's I think an older. Yeah, it's, this is an old Lucas Arts joint. This is like this and Sierra were like the I don't want to say OGs, but they were kind of like the big deal back in the day in PC gaming. Yeah. Like this is a shit you played when you wanted to show your friends how cool. PC gaming was, and you're like, whatever, I have Mario, you toss her, fuck off. Yeah. Like, but I have LucasArts games, and, and they, can your, can your guys swashbuckle? No, I jump on fucking mushrooms, you idiot. What are you doing? Get a Nintendo. I stomp a stomp of the mushrooms. <laughs> I stomp yeah. a stomp a. Um, but there's two versions here. Um, the Curse of Monkey Island Mega Monkey has more puzzles. Mega Monkey. <laughs> Which, tempting, but I kind of want to do just the regular. Yeah, I don't even know what the puzzles are in this game, so I don't know if they would even be good or if that's just li if that's just punishment. Yeah, so I'm going to just... Now, I don't know anything about this game, so I don't know if it's got, like, classic adventure game, like, just rub a thing on a thing till it works going on or what? Yeah, see, I'm not sure either. I do hear monkeys. There are monkeys. So, so far, it's living up to its promise. There are indeed... Oh, God, there's a lot of monkeys. Oh, they don't sound like they're having a good time. It's, okay. like, the, it's like the scene at the beginning of... Uh, is it Space Odyssey? No, what's the one where they're j jacking off in front of Monolith and pass out? I... It's making fun of, like, Space Odyssey or something. Yeah, I think it was Space Odyssey. No, I think it was, it was, uh, it was a Mel Brooks movie, I think. Oh, I have no idea. Oh. Man, movies are hard. I don't know. Tell you what, I like the art style. Yeah, the art style is fantastic. Like, I've played the 3D version. There's a 3D version of this? Not of, like, this game in particular, but there is a 3D, like, early 3D. Ah. Yeah, it's like a two-disc thing, and it's interesting. Yo, you know what we need to do? What? FMV games. I do have Night Trap. We all have Night Trap. Everybody owns Night Trap. And I have others. Yeah, like, everyone has, like, 7th guest in like 11th hour or whatever yeah is this guy riding a, a, a fucking bumper boat in the or bumper car in the water it looks like that's Captain's awesome log. guybrush threepwood <gasps> this is Lost guybrush for days yep. now i have what no a crew or navigational <laughs> instruments no provisions except a half-eaten dumb name and right unless i find water soon i'm surely done for only the hope of finding my love elaine keeps me going oh on my quest He's not for the anything. fabulous nope. treasure called Big Whoop has left me in this sorry state. I thought it would bring me fame and glory. Instead, it delivered me into the clutches of my enemy, the zombie pirate LeChuck. LeChuck. I thwarted LeChuck. his evil plot to marry Elaine, French who was after revenge. LeChuck. Uh, really, really thirsty now. If only I could have a small drink of fresh water, I might have the strength to sail on. Oh, but I know there's nothing but ocean for miles and miles. If I could reach land, I might find water Visual and some comedy. food. Fruit, maybe. Something to fight off the scurvy. <laughs> oh, God. My strength back. Hmm, maybe some bananas. <laughs> oh, why do I torture myself like this? I might as well wish for some chicken and a big mug of grog for all the good it'll do me. <laughs> oh, okay, my I like sweet that. Elaine. Yeah, it's pretty good. Am I cursed to starve here on this ocean without seeing your face just one more time? Am I... Her face just washes past him. Yeah, I was waiting for it. Just in a lame mask. <laughs> the curse of Monkey Island. Yeah, I grew up hearing the name Guybrush Threefwood, but I've never actually like played his game. Like, it, obviously, mm -hmm. so I didn't know who he was. I was just like, "Fuck, that's a dumb name." Yeah, no, it's. He's an interesting character. I like him. Okay. But, like, you'll see. It, it's an, just, it amazes me that he has survived this far. 
Also, that line about I, it, it, I might as well wish for a big thing of grog and a chicken. Like, how I told you we need to see dogma, you need to see dogma. Okay. Beautiful big titty women don't just fall from the sky, you know? It's, that movie is so good. I don't, I don't, I don't, I don't like games putting the, the credits in the beginning like this. Yeah, it's a little strange. It's like, I get it, you want to be more like a movie and you want your people to be recognized and that's cool and everything, but, uh, yeah, me and Guybrush have a date, okay? We got some shit we need to do. Yeah, we got plans and you are currently fucking them up. Yeah, thanks. Eric Wilmunder. You didn't spell any... How do you misspell every part of your own name? Ooh. Ooh, sneeze. Bless you. Peter McConnell, if you're married to Mitch... Married. If you're related to Mitch, please don't punch him in the mouth. Right. Half these people misspelled their own names. They're idiots. How good can this game possibly be? Well, I guess we're gonna find out. Yeah, you're gonna find out. I'm not playing. Yeah, you're just... You're sitting there watching me. Yeah. So, this will be fun. I'm secretly rubbing my nipples. Uh -huh. Just listening to this music. Yeah, see, I can't even tell if he is or not, because I'm facing the other way, so. Yeah. Give it to me, Jonathan Ackley. Larry Ahem. Hooray, Hearn. I can't tell. Your font is questionable. Oh, God. Oh, hello. He seems like a happy chap. Oh, yeah. So I do believe that, of course, that is the Chuck. Oh, and I think How that's many times fine. do I have to tell you, LeChuck? I just don't feel that way about you. Damn. <laughs> Rejection. It hurts, man. I get it. You learn to love me. Sail with me, and I'll make you queen of the dead. I I can't. I'm washing my hair tonight. <laughs> and there's quite a lot of it. Yeah. So you know. All night. Blast be your hair, woman! Can't you see that this salty old sea corpse pines for your every gentle caress? Ew. Nasty. Yeah. Gross. You know, I don't think my father would approve of me dating the undead. And you're probably too nice a zombie pirate for me anyway. Oh shit, she wants a bad boy. Let's just be friends instead. Oh! oh. Friend zone! <laughs> Literally trying to let him down easy. Let's face it, LeChuck. You're an evil, foul-smelling, vile, codependent villain, and that's just not what I'm looking for in a romantic relationship right now. Darn you, riddle, you saucy female. What do you <laughs> mean? <laughs> She's just oh. not that into you, bro. Yeah. You're a bloodthirsty monster who's already kidnapped me once, tortured my friends, and taken from me the only man I ever loved. Guybrush Threepwood. God, imagine having to say wow, that. How right? romantic. Ship ahoy! Threepwood! Fish him out. Guybrush? Guidebrush, Threepwood. By my gangrenous gut, I don't know how you escaped my carnival of the damned. But you won't escape a taste of my blade! He's not a very good pirate. No, he's not. <laughs> oh, the lass has spirit. -y. I think the only good pirate present Throw is. Throw him in the hole, and I'll finish him <laughs> after the battle. Guybrush is clearly not very good at this. And prepare the flame. Like, how do you let yourself get captured from this thing? Voodoo cannonball. <laughs> Voodoo cannonballs. Oh. The device of the zombie pirate LeChuck. Wow. Starting All off right. with a bang. Okay. Okay. All right. <laughs> I've got to get out of here and help Elaine. If I could only get through this one door. Oh right, this is an adventure game. Yeah. Fuck. Slip over the side and make for the shore. Quit your mumbling, captive. He's clearly just going through the motions. He doesn't care about his job. He's like, whatever. Just hit him in the head with a cannonball. This will make you rue the day. 
Why do I have helium balloons? Why do you have helium balloons? All right, tie them. Tie the helium balloon to the small guy, and he'll fly away. I don't think you like that. Ah. I can't use a balloon with that. All right, stick him on the cannonballs, because that makes sense. What? I can't use a balloon okay. with that. He has to walk over there to tell you you're an idiot. Yeah. It's the usual. Oh, look, rope. How do I take things? I don't know. Is there, like, any kind of interface? Uh, this is it. <laughs> okay. Prepare for your doom. Do it. Kill him. You drink oh. bilge water and your mother's dress, you funny. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, exactly. I feel attacked. Right. Oh. What? I Let's held the button and now drink. I have options. Oh. Okay. Okay. What are the options? I can't really read them. Uh, talk and examine. All right, talk to the midget. Oh God. Okay. <laughs> ah! Arg! Hi. <laughs> <laughs> Is that a real eye patch? Is that a real eye patch? I sure it be real. <laughs> Why are you wearing a monocle underneath it? It keeps the dust out of me eye socket. Hey, wait That's a fair. minute. Ooh. You're not a pirate, Wally. Don't you recognize me? It's Guybrush Threepwood. Oh, gee. Hello, Mr. Wood. The last time I saw you, we were prisoners in LeChuck's dungeon. Why would you sign on with a ship of the living dead? Well, Mr. Brush, at first I had some misgivings about it. But thanks to LeChuck's seminars, motivational <laughs> lectures, and audio books on parrot, I've become a On parrot? Oh, that's author. funny. You can, too. <laughs> Ask me how. You can do it! Quack. Oh no. <laughs> Tell me more! Tell me more! Oh god. <laughs> this is an infomercial. Be sure to drink your Ovaltine. Arg. <laughs> Tell me about these audiobooks. To become a pirate, the audio books on parrot are the key. You get a set of 12 parrots, one a month. Return as many as you like. Keep them all and live. They teach you to talk <laughs> just like a pirate. Keep all them the all and live. All the are in there. <laughs> Blow the man down. Shiver me timbers. Who's a pretty bird? What about all blowing the dudes? All the a pirate needs to command respect on the high seas. And shiver in their timbers? Tell me about these motivational lectures. Well, they weren't lectures as such. It yeah. was what LeChuck described as flogging the inner child. Whoa, hold Whoa, on. Okay. Okay, that got weird. That yeah, got that weird got real very quick. strange. Call the police. <laughs> Wee woo wagon. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. uh, what about the seminars? Tell me about these seminars. The seminars really brought things into focus. You don't know how empowering it is to be able to say to yourself, yes, I am a despicable, filthy, villainous pirate deserving blame and censure, but that pirate is who is this I a want thing? to be. Everyone was I don't know. very supportive. This sounds we like a kink this thing. Great feeling of synergy. Then I'm kind of into it. Chuck kicked down the door and said, be. "I want to be a dirty pirate." Scum. Get back to work, or I'll beat you with your own legs. Damn. Jeez. That's pretty hot. Oh. I'm not gonna <laughs> go with that yet. <laughs> just crush his little tiny dreams. Yeah. Just I'll break what little Spirit has left. Ooh, yeah, just crush that's it. That's the door to the Chuck's treasure hold. There's heaps and piles of gold and silver. He's brought all the loot he's ever stolen to give to Elaine. LeChuck is convinced that he can buy Elaine's love. Hmm. I mean, she is a woman after all. Ha <laughs> ha uh, ha. Let's see. What plans. are LeChuck's plans? He's been working on a secret weapon. Some incredibly powerful cannonball. He's going to use it to blow down the walls of the fort. So his crew can overrun the island. There is nothing more romantic than destroying a woman's home. Oh yeah, so romantic. They love it. Snap out of it, Wally. That's blood nose to you, you scurvy sea bass. Tell him, tell him the truth. Break his tiny spirit, crush him. You're a failure as a pirate. Shut your trap, you yellow bellied blowfish. Oh, Midget has some spunk. You and I'll do, you in. Ooh. do what now? Do him in. 
Try it, Shrimpy. Do it. Try it, Shrimpy. Yes, Gabriel Crush his Bob. tiny soul. One more word and I'll <laughs> let you have it. <laughs> word. That's it. <laughs> I'm gonna blast you. I'm gonna... I'm gonna... <laughs> Uh oh! You I broke him. I did. I just can't. You broke the tiny bastard. You're right, Mr. Wood. I'm just not a pirate. Oh. I'm not ferocious or bloodthirsty or hateful or anything. I'm not even. I'm not even unpleasant. Oh, oh. You're a little unpleasant. <laughs> oh. Oh. Well, there, there. Pick up the hook. It'll come in handy later. <laughs> Holy crap. I can't believe that worked. Mm, they're too heavy to carry. So I have talked to cannonballs. Talk to the cannonballs. Yeah. Aww. Nice cannonballs. <laughs> Can you pick up Wally? I'm gonna I don't try. Think I've ever seen a cuter pirate. Oh, ruffle his little hair. Push him. Push the fucker down the hole. Little guy around. Oh. Hey everyone, thank you so much for watching. I just want to take a minute to ask that if you haven't already, please take a second to like and subscribe if you'd like to see more. And if you're looking to show even more support, there's a link to my Patreon in the description below this video. You can see everything you get right here on the screen, and I'm always looking for more perk ideas from you guys. So let me know what you'd be into. I think that's about it. Bye, guys.